Absolutely, but I mean, I can only speak from experience, and that kind of hits both sides of the coin with me there, Jane, completely. I, you know, was flabbergasted this morning. When you read the age, 30 to 35, I was 41 two weeks ago, and I've always said that because of my mum and the cancer gene that I was very reluctant to have a child. However, like you said, you might not have met the right person. Well, I'm really lucky that, you know, over the past three years, I feel that I've met the right person and the person who I would want to be the father of my child and so I kind of want to think that the NHS would be able to help me should I need it um, but I've changed my opinion on sort of where where my sort of morals lie now you know because maybe I could be a good mother maybe I might be a good mother I, you will always tell me that don't you you, would be. Or, you know you love your nephews oh, more than anything my don't you? nephews are my are my world and maybe it is my time but you know I don't want to have this lid on it that says no you can't have any help um that I want to be able to think that that I could you know because I feel like I've met the right person and should I want to try and have a baby that Maybe I can. Yeah, but uh, no one. I mean, I suppose that the argument there is that no one's saying you can't, but you just have to pay for it yourself. Yes, and that was the decision I'd have to make. It's like when people said about my surgery. You know, people said, "Well, you're lucky enough to be able to afford it." Well, of course, yes, I was. But I think, do I let Mother Nature take its course, or am I am I too old? I'm at this real sort of crossroads in my life where I I don't know what to kind of do. Do I go on that seesaw, that seesaw? Or I mean, you're the, you're the classic actually because you have pretty much always said you don't want to have children. Always. And now you're sort of because maybe because you're getting to that age where you're now seeing that that choice might be taken away from you. That's the thing. It kind of really makes you think, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. It makes you think like, again, because it's stamping the age. Being 41, where I think maybe 15 years ago people said, oh, you're too old. Now I don't think that's the case. I think now, you know, and I always wanted my career. You know, I always wanted to kind of not be thinking of having a child so early. Um, whereas I think it was expected where I lived, all my other friends had the kids so early in life. But now, who knows, maybe yeah. it is my time to... Go so early. Oh! oh. <laughs> That's what I needed. Yeah. Have you got your um, turkey baster with you? I have, actually. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I've won, I've won Jane's dressing room, there but we that's go. The, that's the argument here, is that because, you know, a lot of people in life now, women in particular, we go, oh, I'm not going to have a baby till I meet the right person, I'm going to be responsible, I'm going to make sure that I don't have a child until I can afford to pay for it myself, and that means we stay longer and longer and longer in the workplace, and then we get to the age of, say, 40 or even 35 and go... OK, I'm going to do this now, and we find it doesn't happen. Yeah, yeah. And, and we need help. So It's yeah. only when, I, like you said, when I've had my nephews and I've been so lucky because, like, say, my brothers let me in and let me be a big part of their life that, you know, you kind of think it's the next stage. So when, when your other half says to you, right, so what's next? Now I've started going, oh, maybe it is the child. Maybe that is the next stage of the relationship. Or do I carry on, you know, saying to you today, and I love what you said, Jane, like I said, well, I'm going on a holiday this week. And it's like, you know, will that stop me from doing what I want in my life because I've been happy enough for 41 years without having a child? Or do I think the child will be a restraint? Or do I just go, and you said, no, you pick the kid up and, and off, you, off yeah. you go on your holidays. <laughs> exactly. It's that easy. But I've just gone so far without it. Yeah.